From Beaver to Wild, Jerry Fitzgerald did not have to travel far after his playing days were up at Bemidji State last spring. Fitzgerald signed a contract with the Minnesota Wilds minor league team, the Iowa Wild, and he is now participating in training camp to try and make the NHL roster. I loved it in Iowa. Um, I played uh, 16 games last year after my uh, college career, and so it just helped a lot uh, for where I'm at now and uh, for the season to come up. Fitzgerald was excited to get the call back to training camp this year and is looking to prove he belongs with the best. I think it's gone well. Um, I'm starting to feel more comfortable out there uh, with all the guys and um, just trying to work hard every day and try to make an impression and try and get in the lineup. And Fitzgerald will have at least one teammate in his corner as he tries to make the NHL roster as Bemidji State alum Matt Reed also joins the Wild this year. And Reed was pretty impressed with what he's seen from Fitzgerald so far. He has great speed and great uh, good hands and good vision. So, uh, you know, obviously, uh, you know, those, those things go a long way in this league. And uh, it's good to see another Bemidji State uh, guy here in the locker room with us. We uh, kind of talk a little bit about Bemidji. And, uh, yeah, it's just great seeing him around the rank, another Bemidji guy. So mm -hmm. it's nice to see another uh, alum. Reed joins the Wild after seven years with the Philadelphia Flyers. And he's excited to play for the team he rooted for while in college. get to play in front of uh, you know, my wife's family. They all live around here and some friends that live around here. And uh, you know, it's uh, a great hockey state. And it's, uh, it's obviously they have good, good crowds here. And it's, it's exciting to be here. Reed will almost certainly be on the NHL roster come October. And Fitzgerald is trying to make Bemidji State fans very happy as he looks to become the second Beaver to make the squad. Reporting from St. Paul, Anthony Scott, Lakeland News.